Minari, Minari, let's go. Welcome to another mukbang. If this is your first time here, please hit that subscribe button. Answer these questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? My name is James, and this is Mark, and we live stream every Monday and Friday at 6 p.m. Pacific time. Bonus points for if you could tell what Mark said in our intro, because one of our mics was muted during that time. Any any guesses? Any guesses? Did if you could read lips. Did mute me out? I have no idea why it was muted. Good thing I caught it then. It would have taken me a hot minute to figure out that. It was innately intentional, probably. Yeah, because I don't like your interest. I was like, you know what? This week, I'm just going to silence you. You think I'm that vindictive of a person? That's scary if you think that's who you're married to. Anyhow, if you guys clicked on this video, you guys know that we are paying homage to the movie Minari. Am I saying that correctly? Minari. Minari. So we're going to get all into that. We're going to talk about the movie. We're going to make some references to the food and all that jazz. Uh, we actually watched it over the weekend. Yeah. And we before can tell you. Before the Oscars. Actually. Before the Oscars. Yeah. yeah. Um, the Oscars was just yesterday. Um, so we'll tell you guys all about um, the movies, I guess, without spoilers. Um, but let's get to everyone's chat, first of all. We got uh, Beatrice. Welcome. Hope everyone had a great weekend. We got Rush Girl. Happy James and Mark Day, everyone. Hi, Olivia. Hi, uncles. Happy Monday. We got Bonnie saying happy Monday live. Welcome, welcome. We got Josie. It's welcome. Tony says, my favorite part of the week. What? Hell of a day. <laughs> That's amazing. We got uh, Bonnie. Hi, Bonnie. And Flyvende, welcome. Happy Monday. Just checking in to wish you a good evening. I have to get back to work soon. Double shift. I will join you on Friday. Enjoy the stream. Flyvendi, thank you so much. And thank you also for joining our channel membership. We, we secretly, quietly introduced the channel membership to our stream. Do you just want to give like a quick elevator pitch on what, it, what yeah, that is? Yeah, so we did a soft launching, soft launching of our membership program. So if you become a member, which is a monthly subscription fee, you'll have access to us. <laughs> <laughs> access to more content yes yes and um if you guys notice in today's stream when you look at the chat on youtube you'll see little cute badges so right now everyone who signs up will get a cute little french fry badge that says new and then as as um you stay on as a member longer your badges gets upgraded too it's called loyalty yes loyalty. yes so Thank you guys all for being here. We also have another channel member. Thank you, Michael, for signing up today. We really appreciate it. Mr. Jin. We're we're uh we're figuring out like we're having like founding founding members. I think the first how oh. many how many members should we consider founding members? 13. 13. Is that how many there were for the US? No, I just think think the about colonies? 13 colonies. Okay. <laughs> all right. And I think right now, right before the stream started, I think we were at five. Oh so gosh, we're, we're already wow. almost halfway there. We, and we didn't fully like launch it yet. Yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. We got Stray Cat and Elda, welcome to the live stream. We got Teresa. Hi, Hannah, welcome to the live stream. Bear the Barrier, welcome. Uh, we got a new member, a new oh. founding. We're going to call it new founding father and mother. Just to be inclusive, or should we just found a founder? Founder. Founding member. Founding member, okay. Yeah. New founding member. Brenda, thank you so much for joining the channel membership. We really oh, it appreciate shows it. Up green on our end. Yeah, it's yeah. really nifty. It does highlight your comment really well. Yeah. Okay, gonna get our way through to the stream. I mean the chat. Let's see. We also got Tony. Tony, thank you also for joining our channel membership. We oh super appreciate that. That is amazing. So the other thing that um, you'll notice is if you sign up to our channel membership on our community tab on YouTube, there's channel member posts only. So on there, we posted what we're doing for our Wednesday. Uh, oh, so mukbang. we can't talk about it. So we can't talk about it today, but oh. if you sign up, you, you can find out exactly. And we'll give you guys all the behind the scenes scoop. We got Rachel to April. Welcome to the live stream. Hi, Emerita. See, we got K Moo. 
Okay, Moo, we need to talk about this uh, Minari movie because we're not going to spoil the ending, but he said he really liked it, but I felt like for us, the ending was... Hmm. I liked it. You liked the ending? Yeah. I I li- let's I talk offline about it. Movies that make you think after the movie ends. Oh, that's true. Like, and you're like, and you come up with your own like conclusion. Mm, the that. continuation of it. Got yeah. it. We got Evelyn. Welcome to the live stream. And Teddy and Noah are here. Thank you both for being here. Hi, hi. We got Nancy. Thank you for being here. We got Girl Goku. My favorite food is pizza. Excellent. Chungi Funk, welcome. Hannah says, I love the new logo change. You know what? We just kind of re Like, I don't know if you noticed, but I kind of moved things around. Oh, you did. Yeah. I guess it's hard for us to see, but it, it looks cleaner. It showered. Yeah. <laughs> yes, don't forget to like this video. We have a couple of Minari-themed uh, things on the wheel today, so you guys will enjoy that. We got Tom Choo Choo. Welcome. Hi, Kidney J. How are you? Welcome to the live stream. We got Carnesha. Jen A, thank you guys all for being here. So what does membership to this OnlyFans get? It's not an OnlyFans. Yeah, don't call it Don't only call it that. Fans. We're going to shut down real quick. It's not. It's nothing like OnlyFans, we swear. But, <laughs> but I also heard that some celebrities do OnlyFans. It's not sexual. Yeah. It's just like, hey, you want to know what I'm work- what project I'm working on before it gets released in public? Like that kind of stuff too, right? right so that's right, kind of right. like it yeah. for us. We got Redbone here. Thanks for being here. Uh, they had spicy chokpal. Ooh. Oh, James has been wanting a chokpal. Yeah. yeah. Tina says, I'm making sea bass from Costco because I was inspired by you. Good luck with that. Let us know how it turns out. It's going to be good. Hopefully, it turns out good. Yeah. We got RKS Gamer. Welcome to the live stream. I'm sorry if I'm falling behind. I'm going as fast as I can today. We got Laura B. Hi, Laura. How are you doing? Oh, we got a new founding member, Nancy. Nancy. Thank you so much for joining our channel membership. Thank you. Yes, wear that badge with pride, y'all. We got Tater Cakes and Julia. Thanks for being here. Hope you guys are all having a great Monday. We got Jansen. Hi, Jansen. Skadaddy says hi. Dana Dana says hi, all. Esmeralda, Julie, Mayflowers, Exhill. So many, so the many people. Cruise, the whole gang is here. The whole crew's here. Uh, Brenda's a mini review. Min- Minari was eh, and Steven, Steve Yoon's, is that his, how you say his last name? Yeah. Yoon? Korean American accent killed it for me. I did ask Mark within the first like two minutes of the movie. I was like, how good is his accent? On a scale of one to zero to It should have been more Korean than his American accent. Sure. But then again, he's an American actor. You know, he's yeah, from yeah, yeah. Korea, so yeah. Uh, Julie says, did you watch the movie online? How did we watch the movie? We watched it. It's available on Amazon Prime or uh, Google Play, but you have, but it costs money though. Yeah. So we chose Google Play, but we could have also ordered it from Amazon. And it gives us like uh, up to 30 days to watch, but once you watch it, you only get to 48 hours after you watch it to re- to rewatch it again. Yeah. We got Heather, also oh, a new founding new member. member. Thank you so much for, I called it the appetizer level because as it grows, we'll have other levels, but we wanted to start off very humble. Yeah. So we're calling it the appetizer level and then maybe we'll do like entree, dessert, prefix. I don't know. I was thinking all these names. I was thinking, Ooh, I would like that name. Oh. Let's table that. Remember that. I'm okay. gonna remember it. <laughs> oh, and then the omakase level. Maybe we could just like I don't know, do a sushi like stream or something. I don't know. There's a lot of possibilities with it. But thank you so much for supporting us on there. We got JMO. It's Monday. Let's go. That rhymed. We have another founding member, Bonnie. Thank you so much oh for joining gosh. our channel membership. I don't. I can't even keep track of how many we're at right now. I don't know, but, but you know what? Like whoever signs up today if it surpasses 13 we'll still count you towards the founding member sure and oh, it's yeah. just namesake but we'll yeah. just count whoever whatever we get today yeah. yeah on the back end youtube tells you exactly what day you sign up so oh that'll be you, you guys are part of history right now uh low rules says hi all eating yuki jung awesome mm. 
Thank you, May, saying that we are looking great. I'm not feeling like 100%. It's not like I'm sick or anything, but I'm just not feeling 100%. Con your condition is not 100%. Yeah, but you guys are getting me all like amped up again. So that's yeah. a good thing. Larissa says, hello, my very couple. Did I miss anything? I think you didn't miss any much. We're just saying hi to people. We're just starting out. J Dreams, welcome. Hey, guys. Hey, what's up, dude? And Bond's like, we will definitely dive into this further in a moment. What is Minari? Stick around. You will find out. Redbone, thank you so much for joining our channel membership as another founding member. It's amazing. Okay. Again, after the stream is over, make sure you take advantage of the content that we're going to be posting on our community tab. And then, yeah, keep chatting in the chat so people can see all your French fry badges. <laughs> I mean, I think they're cool. I like it. Yeah. Oh, and so it doesn't show the emojis on the back end, but on YouTube, uh, there are emojis that you will have access to. Special emojis. Special ones. So there's one of my face and there's one of your face. I feel like we need to do more faces. And actually, the founding members will get to decide additional emojis okay. because YouTube only gives you a certain amount. And then as more people sign on, they unlock more. So you guys are going to decide what else you want us to put as emojis. And we will uh, definitely... Consider that. Thank you all. Michael, there for our uh, explanation of me, Natty, if you cannot wait. We got Angelina. Angelina is the founding member. The, the very old. The very first. She gave birth to us. <laughs> Not to us, maybe. Maybe to the, the, mem the membership. I mean, however you, I mean, do you want that title, so Angelina? Whoever like whoever members after Angelina came out of her womb. Oh, my word. <laughs> But Angelina, we really appreciate your support. Thank you so much. Aww. We got another uh, channel membership from Mayflowers. Mayflowers, oh thank you gosh. so much for joining our channel membership. This is very exciting. Oh my God. And we also got Chris. Chris, thank you so much for also joining the membership. Oh my gosh. Y'all, now I feel like we gotta like send out all this exclusive content now. I know, now <laughs> play, um, play around with the special access emojis. Yeah, um, yeah. I think the ones that are available is your face, my face, Hedu, and then the chummy bird, right? So enjoy those. And we're adding more as we as we go along. Angelina says, that makes my heart so happy. Well, there you go. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, we got yours truly, darling. Welcome to the live stream. Happy Monday. Uh, Brenda says, I'll sponsor someone's membership for two months. Well, how does that work? How do we do that? Maybe we gotta Brenda figure. could choose. Yeah, we we'll Brenda, talk. Yeah, we'll, we'll chit chat with Brenda and figure out how how to make that happen. And oh, and we have the same. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm I'm getting like channel membership. This this this. You guys are so generous. Thank you so much. Okay, ready? Yeah. Brenda, Brenda, Brenda thank, thank you. you. We appreciate you. <laughs> it's our pom pom. Minati is our pom poms. That's excellent. And Chunky Funk, my life story. Thank you so much for joining our That's channel awesome membership. Member. I mean, I feel like we're I, past 13 now. I am just so shocked that we didn't even officially made it public. I mean, it's public, but we didn't publicly announce it. And it's already getting a lot of members. Yeah. Oh thank my you God. so much we for showing us love. On people who especially watch us every single live. Mm, yeah. yeah, you're all the ones that. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. This is very oh exciting. My gosh. Uh, Julia is making Alfredo tonight. That sounds excellent. Oh my god, Erica is here. Erica, who actually came from Angelina, <laughs> yeah, is here. Hi, Erica. Or Pac. That's weird calling her Erica. I'm just reading the name out loud, and I was like. Ugh. Uh, oh my God, Teddy, thank you so much for joining the channel membership. You guys are going to be like, we're just talking about channel memberships all stream. Well, but thank you for showing us love. This is amazing. This the momentum is like we're on a wave right now. A tidal wave. Yeah. Brennis is still on a shot for that super chat, though. I mean, I think we. this is a celebratory occasion with everyone uh, joining as members. We just really appreciate it, and we can definitely do that. Peck Poodle. Peck Poodle. In Jung. Yeah. <laughs> Heather says, I can tell Mark is surprised. This is overdue, yo. <laughs> we want to be in your club, right? 
Oh, okay, yeah, maybe a bouncer is, you know, I kind of only. You know how we've always wanted like um, a name for people that watch us. We've never done that, so I also feel like don't we need a name for our membership? It, it just I don't want to just call it membership. I want to call it something fun, you know. Ooh, what so don't we you think help, about that. Yeah, why don't you help us? Uh, if you the have any members, ideas, maybe you could come up if with. If you have any name. ideas, uh, for suggestions, sure. Yeah, we got Sanina in the chat. Welcome to the live stream. And he says, let's make James and Mark the brave girls of YouTube. So what level are we at right now? So what status we are we? Have to wait like four years after. It's been four years. <laughs> it, we're going on five in July. Wait. Yeah, five. Well, you know what? We need to find a random fan to upload a video of us or something. They have, and then I copyright strike them. <laughs> <laughs> Um, thank you guys so much. Uh, Hannah just wants to see if you can give a little bit more of your shirt. Sure. So it's in Korean. Oh, where is it? It says "kon prostitute." That's how you say. I thought it. you said "kon prostitute." <laughs> no. I know that's not what you said though. Poor corn. <laughs> Soft poor corn. What'd you say? I'm confused. <laughs> but it means. So it says "kon." Prostitute, which, ah. which is corn frost in Korean. But I'm wearing this shirt because it's in Korean, even though it's frosted flakes. Uh, because we're doing it, like what James said, an homage to Minari. Yeah. So yeah, why don't we jump right into that? Um, real quick, though, Brenda has decided that she wants to give her super chat towards Josie. So we'll figure out how to make that happen oh i think gosh. josie okay. will have to do it on her end but we can send her yeah the, yeah okay the funds to get started but yes thank you so much all right so minari minari what is minari minari is an herb i called it a vegetable in our description <laughs> well, <it's laughs> but i guess it is an herb vegetable, but it's technically i want to say it's an herb that um in the movie, they made a reference that it's kind of like weed, mm. but then Korean, a lot of Asian people use it as um, part of food, you know, herb toppings, or even part uh, as a medicine too. Yeah. But I think the commonly known English name, I've seen different versions: water celery, water parsley, water um, dropwort. Yeah, I've heard of dropwort. Dropwort. So those are all three names for the same thing. I don't know why. Just choose one. I, I think the International Association of Minari couldn't think of a common English name. I don't but, know. Minari sounds like a beautiful like name. Like a it could be a name because mm. I've heard of Mina. So like why oh, yeah, not add a name yeah. to it? But it's, it's Mina with the last name Lee. <laughs> so you want to try? Yeah. It just tastes like an herb. Oh, it's, it's it kind of looks like flat leaf parsley. It's strong. Mm, oh, very strong. Yeah. Mm. But it's really good. So in Korean cuisine, uh, a lot of it is like after you make like some kind of soup or stew and you at the very end, you put a a bunch of minari on top and let that cook down for a couple minutes and mm. eat it. Yeah. So that's pretty common. Kind of like in hot pot, you know how you really like the um, looks like uh, crown daisy? Yes. I love it's crown like, daisy It's there. so similar to crown daisies in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but today we're not gonna make a soup or stew. Um, we're actually going to make minari pancake. It's gonna be super healthy for you. Yeah. So this so, is what it, this is what it looks like, uncut. <laughs> <laughs> and if you've seen the movie, you uh, and this is not a spoiler, so I'm gonna show yeah. It. In the movie, um, they you know someone tries to grow minari and it just looks like this in the near the water creek. A bunch of this. So this is what Minari is. This is um one that's already prepped, cleaned, and chopped for our pancake. And in addition to this dish, because uh, making the pancake alone isn't going to get us full, what else are we making? So special, um, uh, you know, I guess. Kudos to Soul Meals again. Uh, we. Um, receive this pre-marinated uh, mini octopus spice in a spicy sauce. So this is already cooked for us. 
Mm. And not cook. This is already marinated for us. So mm -hmm. we're just gonna cook this, stir fry it in front, and then eat that with. Maybe we'll make fried rice afterwards. Ooh, yeah. that sounds delicious. So we're eating two things today. Yeah. Um, the other thing that you guys probably saw in our thumbnail is Mountain Dew. Oh. So there's a significant there's a reference to Mountain Dew in the movie. So we just thought it'd be fun to grab grab it as well. So if you want to see us what drink that. What perfect timing, because James has been kind of craving Mountain Dew for the past month, but we really didn't have any. Oh, actually, you asked me to pick up Mountain Dew at the liquor store once. A while ago, I, but I'm glad you didn't, because you know I've been drinking a lot more soda than I would like, but it's okay. Well, anyways, so perfect timing. James has been wanting to drink Mountain Dew. Yeah. So we're going to chill for a little bit. We got Austin uh, joining us. Hi, Austin. Welcome to the live stream. Uh, Emerita is suggesting, how about chummies? That's kind of funny because yeah, we, I would do it more in a heartbeat if they actually like, you know, but I don't want to call it chummies just because. Oh, cause yeah. You know, but I like that idea. The concept is there. Jammies. And what about your name? We're not going to come up with it tonight. I don't think so. Yeah. And of course, yes, uh, we, we appreciate everyone even just tuning in. So don't feel pressured if you aren't able to do the membership at this time. And as Mark said, we're not taking away anything. This is just additional ways to help support us and additional ways for us to give you guys more content. So yes, please do not feel bad at all. We still love equally mm -hmm. all viewers, subscribers and non-subscribers alike. Although a little bit more likeness to the subscribers. Just FYI, I'm being honest. Because subscribing for sure is free. Yes. So subscribe if you so have that, not. That actually makes us the most happy. Yes. Is if you just subscribe. Yeah. Regardless of the membership or whatever, it's just if you hit the subscribe button, that's how you get into our hearts. Yeah. We got Kat saying, hi, my favorite YouTubers. Thank you for being here. We got toilet bowl food reviews in the house. Welcome oh, to the live stream. Interesting screen there. Redbone, thank you so much. Saying, James and Mark, look at all the overwhelming amount of love and support you're receiving from your subscribers. Our subscribers are obviously the best. Oh, thank you so much. Sure. Pack, thank you so much for joining our channel membership. Oh, that's exciting. That is very yeah. exciting. Thank, thank you so you. much. Uh, do you know what Crown Daisy is called in Korean? Sukka. Sukka. Oh, that sounds like the card in Japan for the train. Oh, uh, suka. Yeah, suka. Yeah, suka. Very suka. similar. Uh, not as pretty sounding as Minari. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, my hair is just fading and fading and fading. Tiho says Min Minari was such a great movie. I've seen it three times now. Awesome. Yeah, Hi, Cindy. Yeah, if people don't mind, we could talk about it without trying to give away the spoiler. Yeah, me, we might even just say, you know, mute this part and like, while we get to um, that. So what are we drinking today? Do you want to, do you want me to grab you a drink or something? Um, I need to set this on so that it doesn't turn off again. I'm going to start off with, we have chum in the freezer. You said you wanted. Why don't we do our first, uh, Chummy Mountain Dew. We'll do that as a shot. Even though, that's on the Even though that's on the wheel because, and then if you guys want us to do it again, we'll just keep liking this video. How about a, maybe a small cocktail? Then? Okay. Just Okay. <laughs> Chummy is frozen. Our freezer's been colder lately. Yeah, it's working overtime. Ooh. It's totally frozen. DD, welcome to the live stream. If I didn't subscribe with Bell Reminder, I would forget. Yeah, make sure if you haven't already, click on that bell so that uh, you don't miss any of our live streams. And yeah, if someone can give me an update, did we hit our first like goal yet? We got 97 people here, so chances are we're close to the first 50. 
<laughs> Perfect time for chipples. This is like torture if we had to do it with this thing. <laughs> uh, I might. Sure. I'm just going to keep mixing it. So. Yeah. Hey, TVL, did your scalp burn? Oh, boy, did it. Uh, the actual bleach was fine, but once the color started getting applied, it was already so raw that once the color got added, I felt like it was just breathing fire. But after that, I survived, so. We got Deja saying hi, welcome to the live stream. And it looks like we are already at our first, like, um, oh, threshold. Okay, so let's, let's spin the wheel. Okay for the like goal and then that gives us another minute or two for this to kind of defrost a little bit it's kind of getting there it's, now it's like slushy yeah all right so here's the wheel are you ready oh you made it be nutty color yeah <laughs> <laughs> just keep it in theme yeah oh a spin of that wheel we got i think a Maybe three or four new, uh-oh. Uh-oh, no. So I know Julie's here. She's gonna oh, is Julie she's here? She's gonna be pissed. She'll be like, F no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, I feel so bad. Uh, do I plan on doing it again? I don't know, but I feel like Having different hair colors is giving me like new, I don't know, zest in life. Like, feel like, you know, he's become more fun. a new person. Yeah. He thinks he's cool now. <laughs> James is always cool. And Marita says, I'm getting confused. So many colors and stuff on the chat. I'm trying to keep up, but I love it. Yes, the more colors, the better. That's what we like. Rainbow, taste the rainbow. Um, Minari. Minari. You know what's so fitting is all of the new channel memberships are coming in as green. Derf, thank you so much for becoming a channel member on our channel. Oh, is that the Derf? Yeah. You know? oh, yeah. God, thank you so much. Thank you got the whole the family Mil becoming members. Amelia. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. That's awesome. Thank, thank you. you so much. All right, so we're just going to do a simple cocktail, Chumpy and Mountain Dew. That's it. Have you ever had that combination? I've never had this combination. You know what? It's been, I don't know, at least 20 years for me since the last time I had Mountain 20. Dew. 20. I just don't really um, I You never even drank the kid. red one? Oh, the red one? Yeah, but still, that was still yeah. a long time ago. So I don't even know what it tastes like. Can I have a request? Yeah. Since I haven't had it in a while, can you just pour me a little bit so I can just drink it without the cocktail made, and then the cocktail right after. I'm just going to take a quick drink. He's like, mm, can I get a complicated order? That's like, not complicated. Okay, pour yourself some. Here. Well, give us another minute for this to uh, uh, okay. be frost. Uh, I'm not able to highlight Julie's comment, but she said, I stopped painting my toes to announce my displeasure of nothing happening. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Julie. We should just call it, like, a new name just to make Julie even more mad. Uh Julie's favorite wheel wipe. <laughs> Do you want any straight up or are you okay? I'll take a sip. Just to remember, just to reunite your taste buds from the 20 years we've been missing out on this. I, yes, I had it as a kid. And it's so funny that this was referenced in the movie Mountain Dew, um, which I didn't know. How old is Mountain Dew? Because I thought. It was new when I was a kid. I'm looking on here like there's a date for it, but I don't think so. But yeah. apparently it might have been around even longer than that. Because the movie happened probably, actually, actually, well, yeah. yeah. Huh. Anyways. Cheers. Oh, this, it is sweet. Oh, is it? Hmm. It doesn't taste like what I remember. It tastes, but I'm not disappointed either. It it tastes like green. <laughs> if I had to imagine a green soda, this is what the Mountain Dew tastes like. Like everything on here is like green, green, and then there's. Oh my god! Is this St. Patrick's Day? I'm like, I'm, am I getting confused? We did miss what it. What is so. going on here? 
<laughs> All right, so are you ready for a melting decoy? I am ready. I'm going to put this here so people can see better. I don't even know what that is, low rules, but Mountain Dew, enjoy the brominated vegetable oil. Ooh, that sounds delish. <laughs> Latanya, welcome to the live stream. Redland saying, Mark, he thinks he's cool. Mark on fire tonight, fire back James. You know what, I don't think that was even a dig at me, to be honest. Thinks he's cool, honestly, no. Uh, Joanne, hi, first live, yippee, welcome to the live stream. And for those of you who are new and have not yet answered these questions. Where are you from? What's your favorite food and how did you find us? I even changed the, see, like when we hit a like goal, I changed it so that it's our two favorite colors. So we hit 50, so now it's orange. Uh, we got Kosh here, hi Kosh. Cheers to our water. Ooh, it don't there. smell good. It oh, doesn't taste bad at all, actually. It actually taste tastes chunny. like it could be a haichu or something. Yeah, it doesn't taste bad with the or with the soju at all. Mm. Yeah. Sicily, welcome to the live stream. Mountain Dew Baja Blast is my favorite. So is Baja Blast the red one or the blue one? And apparently Mountain Dew was invented in 1940. Got it. What? Yeah. Avril, welcome to the live stream. And we got Elaine. Hi, Elaine. 1940, my gosh. Uh, we have not ventured out to Sonics to get the ice yet, no. But that's on her bucket list. <laughs> oh, Baja Blast is the red one? The red one was? I think so. It's okay. Now, do you remember Surge? I have no of it, but I don't think I remember ever drinking it. I've had Surge. Is it orange? No, Surge also this looks color? like Mountain Dew to me, but it came out because like Mountain Dew, I think they were advertising itself as like, get your source of, like before, you know, Red Bull or whatever. It was like people drink Mountain Dew because it gave them that extra kick. So they came out with Surge mm. and they pumped that soda with caffeine and I think it became controversial or something. So they got rid of it or something oh. like that. Does anyone know what happened to Surge? Ooh. Oh, Hedy came out. He's sniffing for something. The Oxtel, probably. Did you know that the Oscars was at the uh, Union Station? Yeah. I'm trying to remember, like, so what part were they even at? For probably the, just one of the... There, There is a lot of space inside Union Station, so maybe... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, TVL says Mountain Dew was actually created to be a whiskey chaser. We have... We do have... Well, what do we have? We have... Hennessy, we have Are um, any of those whiskey? Saz Sazerac rye. Is Sazerac rye whiskey? They're all like whiskey family. Yeah. Mm. Maybe we'll do that in place of it. We have oh we have that one. shot of Jack Daniels right there. Oh, we have oh. Gentleman Jack. Where? Um, our uh, on air box comes with. Oh yeah yeah. Here. Oh, we should do that next week. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. Uh, Julia's not a fan of soda, except for ginger ale. Uh, Cicely is from Houston, Texas. Favorite food is sushi, and I binge watch your lives and mukbangs. Thank you so much. That was Coke's alternative to Mountain Dew. So Coke made Surge. Oh. That makes sense. So this is Pepsi? It is. is I forget. It? Yeah, because Mountain Dew products is never, Mountain Dew's never with the Coke oh, brand, right? Oh, here. They even list the caffeine content for the soda. Guess what it is? Caffeine content in grams? Yeah, in, in grams. 32 grams. Because isn't that 32 grams of sugar? So, so okay. every 12 fluid ounce of Mountain Dew, has 54 milligrams of caffeine. So oh, what's wow. what's in a coffee? I actually don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I actually don't know. I'm like, okay, where, what are you getting at? And then you just completely abandon your thought. 
Joanne is from Maz Mazaltan, Mexico. Love tacos and from Angelina Spicy. Oh, Joanne, nice. thank you so much. We love Angelina Spicy too. Thanks for being here. Yeah. John is here. I accidentally ordered a Green Mountain Dew flavor at Taco Bell. That was so foul. How do you I mean accidentally like Mountain oh, Dew? Oh yeah, how do you accidentally like <laughs> anything Coke. else? Like if you said like well, can I get sweetened iced tea? And they heard you say unsweetened. Like I get that. Mm. But Mountain Dew, what, 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 what did you accidentally say that? Um, uh, what was the original order? I guess. Sale of surge was not as popular, so you could say that there was no surge in sales. <laughs> Good. Plus, surge does really sound like an energy drink. Yeah. Mountain Dew sounds like uh, more. Like peaceful, I guess. I just remember when Surge did come out, like they both did a marketing blitz mm. to make themselves cooler and that energy drink. So like Mountain Dew was like, do the do like I don't know, it's like something like that, and like some like extreme skateboarder like holds up a can, do the do whatever, and like super energetic. And Surge is like, Surge, Surge, like I'm like, annoyed at both commercials. Like they're both trying to <laughs> out energize each other. Mm, I mean about that. Michael likes uh, ginger ale. You know what? I was craving because we didn't have anything in our house this weekend, and I actually we have a ginger ale at our bar, and I was like, oh, I should just drink this. So I had a little cup over the weekend. It was nice. John says it was actually white. So the Mountain Dew you probably had was not the green kind. Right. Emerita says, you both look so cool today. How's the weather? You know, it's been overcast all day, so it hasn't been hot. But I heard it's going to be 90 degrees. So. Yeah. I remember this too, Redland. Uh, Mountain Dew was the gamer's drink when I was growing up with Super N N64. Yeah. No way it's a whiskey chaser. You know, stick around the next week. We'll we'll so test it. Instead of like um, ginger ale and Jameson, which is a very popular way to drink Jameson, maybe we should do a new trend and call Mountain Dew Mountain Jameson. <laughs> Mountain Jameson. <laughs> no. What if it's like the new thing and everyone at the cool clubs in Vegas will be like, hey, Give me a Mountain Jameson. And like, oh, they don't cool. even carry Mountain Dews at the bar, huh? If you think about it. They only carry Coke, if it's, if, Sprite, if there's and ginger ale. If there's a popular demand, they're sure. going to carry the Mountain Dew. Should we get our pancake going? I think so. Do you want this back in the fridge? Yeah. Uh, we have not yet tried the Sazerac rye, but we shall very soon. And Redbone's having fun with our emotes or emojis. Squirt and soju or sake is really good, though. Oh, that's a good combo. Okay, so this Minati we're going to set off to the side. And we're going to use this to make our Minati pancake. So this is just one bunch. I don't even know how much this is, but mm -hmm. one bunch of Minati here. And then we have some serrano peppers and red pepper. So I like things with a little bit of kick. Yeah. So here, I'll let you sprinkle that in. <laughs> Durf is enjoying the Doge emote. We'll, ba we'll bounce back from Doge, right? Yes. <laughs> it's still more than what we uh, yeah. got it for, so I'm so happy with it. Tracy, welcome to the live stream. Hi, I'm Deptai James and Opa Mark. Thank you so much for being here. And it sounds like, did we already hit 75 and I'm just lagging behind? Please let me know. We will get to it. Reg and Perry, welcome. Happy Monday to you as well. How's it going, YouTube Toxic? Welcome. So, Regan, we just launched something called Channel Memberships today. So, names are green because uh, we have subs who have signed up to become members. And that's one of the perks, right? Yeah, you get 
your name is i don't i actually don't even see the name so i have to watch the replay to see what what it looks like all right so can you guys guess what this is do you know what it i is? don't know what it is my guess was cheese but i don't think so so what do you guys think this is it's shredded almost like hash browns Oh, so our first, our next like goal is met. Mark, do I have your permission to spin the wheel? Yeah, let's spin the wheel. Oh, we didn't do anything yet because nothing happened. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. So this one, there's something going to happen now. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Subscriber giveaway. Subscriber giveaway. This, this one is... One of my favorite ones. Yeah, so this is how it's gonna work. We're gonna let you guys choose a number between one and 1,000. When we tell you, you're gonna put it in the chat and our mods are gonna be on standby to decide who is the closest. Even if you go over, as long as you're the closest and only do one answer. One guess per person. If you put in multiple guesses, you'll be disqualified. Our mods are like that. <laughs> <laughs> and we love them for that. So we'll count you guys down. So just start thinking of your number. And we'll give you guys about three minutes to get in your guesses. And what do you win if you get closest? A $10 gift card to Amazon Rainforest. Yes. Minus the Rainforest, just Amazon. <laughs> All, right, All right. So put your guesses in right now. One through 1,000. Again, one guess per person. Closest one to the number that is going to be chosen, you get to win a $10 gift card to Amazon. Yes. And we're gonna um, keep this open for three minutes. So put in your guesses. Again, one guess per person. So as you're putting in the guess, did we talk about what this is? No, I don't know if anyone guessed yet. Oh, someone guessed Lotus Root. What do you think it is? It looks like a vegetable of some sort. <laughs> Can I try it? Is it okay, Raw? <laughs> You're not gonna die from it. It's like a mango that had all of its juice sucked out <laughs> and not ripe yet. I don't like it. What is it? I'm sure it'll be better once it's cooked. It's sweet potato. Ooh, <laughs> I don't worry. It's sweet potato raw. We didn't land on that on the wheel. Okay, you girl, guys have two minutes left. My mom made me raw potato juice. Back in the Don't day, punish me you though. Eat one matchstick of raw sweet potato. Oh my goodness. Well, fine. This will make me happy. John just signed up to our channel membership. John, thank you so much wow, for signing up to. Thank you. John is basically the equivalent to like subs on Twitch, I think. Yeah. All right, so let's just toss the sweet potatoes in. Okay. <laughs> We also got a super chat. Oh my God, Hannah, thank you so much for the $41 super chat. Hello, choose your drink of choice. Uh, do, Mountain Dew Sierra Mist Squirt, and I'm moving in with my BF soon to test it. Oh, oh congrats. Oh. So out, yeah. out of those three sodas. We only have 7-Up or Mountain Dew. Is the 7-Up even cold? I don't know. I thought you bought 7-Up. It's in the trunk still. It's in the trunk. So we will do Mountain Dew. Yeah. With soju then, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. Ready? Hannah, Hannah, thank you. We appreciate you. And actually, just when we go to the market next time, I will pick up Squirt because now I'm craving Squirt again. I have cycles with Squirt. Yeah. Okay. What do we, Ooh. Now, what is this? That I definitely know what it is. It's uh dried shrimp that's been rehydrated <laughs> yeah so this is uh dried shrimp that we kept in our freezer but as james said we just ha had it soaked in water for a yeah. little bit 20 seconds to go y'all get your guesses in i also want to acknowledge our newest channel member regan perry thank you so much for joining our channel membership Woo! yay thank you for being a member yes yeah, so wow, exciting a lot of members thank you all right and Time is up, so the last guest that I am going to take on our end is Tom Choo Choo. So that is the last of it. So we are gonna share our screen right now. Get to our number generator. 
All right, so it's set to one to a thousand. Let's germinate. 197 is the number. So mods, please work your magic. Let us know who is the winner. 197 is the number. The suspense is killing me because I don't really see too many guesses in that range. Really? Yeah. Oh, actually, someone guessed. I see a guess of 202. That's pretty darn that's, close. That's pretty close. Ooh. You should, I feel like I could be blindfolded and I would know exactly everything that you're putting into this pancake today. Uh, we, this, this is best by April 30th, so I'm going to just add extra garlic so we could use as much of this as we can. All right, now it's time to put in our flour and liquid to make the batter. All right, I feel like a couple of mods have called, have declared that Chris with 202 is indeed the closest to one. So oh. Chris, congratulations on winning the subscriber giveaway. All you need to do is find a way to contact me either on Discord, Gmail, or Instagram. Instagram and we will get you all squared away with that. Congratulations again. Congratulations. Yeah, Angelina, as long as they're the closest, we decided that 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 works here. So even if they go over, it's fine. Uh, Island Candies, welcome to the live stream. Mark is in the process of making a Minari pancake. Minari pancake. Would you call it Minari Chon? Yes, that's exactly the name of it in Korea. But I've never had a Minari Chon, right? Or probably? I don't think you have, I don't think actually. so. I don't think so. Yeah. So I'm just gonna... I bought how much flour to maybe one more yeah. half a cup. Yeah, we got some background music going on. It might be low, so you might not hear it as well today. Okay, so I'm gonna do equal parts of this tikum kaidu, which is a special flour. It's technically Korean um, frying mix flour. Usually you could use Korean uh, pinky flour too, but we're trying to make it a little extra crispy. So I'm gonna do equal parts flour and beer. Mm. <laughs> beer, good beer. Testing the beer. Testing the beer. Ooh. Chris says, thank you. I think Minari brought me good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, you know I love me a good savory pancake. Okay. And give this a good toss. Do you want to toss it? Uh, no, it's okay. I'll, I'll manage the chat. Okay. I was going to give you the other plastic gloves. Oh, no. That's, that's exactly why I chose not to. Because if you try to get me to wear this, it would have been a game over. Exactly, beer is going to make it super crispy. Look at Marco in there and giving it a massage. Um, Tiho asks, can Mark pronounce the Korean name for the flower? I'm working on my pronunciation. Is there a name for the flower? Oh, tikim karu. Tikim karu. Tikim means actually like deep fry. Tikim. Mm, tikim. And then karu is powder or flour in this case. Tikim karu. Oh, this smells so good with the Minari flavor and the beer. And the beer, yeah. They should make Minari beer, <laughs> right? <laughs> Let's stick with the pancake first and then start incorporating uh, the beer with Minari. 
So we are not huge movie watchers, but no, we um, don't watch a lot of movies, right? Me and Addy, because of uh, it's been getting a lot more buzz, like closer to the Oscar season. So we're like, you know, and, we're not doing anything tonight. Let's and it got out. a lot of awards that lead because like there's a there's an award circuit where Oscar is like the last step. Mm -hmm. So it actually won a lot of awards at the Golden Globe, at the Writers Guild, at the um like the British version of the Oscars. I forgot what it was called, like BAFTA or something. Oh, like BAFTA, that. yeah. BAFTA. So it did really well. So I was curious. We were curious to watch it. I mean, it was a toss-up at that point between Minati or Mortal Kombat. Our night, our movie night could have gone either way, and we decided on uh, Minati. Well, it's because all you all on Friday was like, tonight's Mortal Kombat night. We're like, what? They came out a movie? We would even know. All right, Loeb. I know you were paying attention, but we did add seafood. What seafood did we add to this mix? Hmm. Anybody know? Drop it in the chat. Shelby, good evening, boys. What is up with this weather? It is cold here. It's 42 degrees here. It's going to snow. Oh, geez. Oh, oh my God. goodness. Where are you again? Key, welcome to the live stream. Y'all, background music is always so relaxing. Can yeah. you all hear it? I didn't know you could hear it. I, when I re-watch the movie, I'm not the movie. When I re-watch our lives, I don't even hear the music. But I'm so glad you could all hear yeah. it. Okay, let's bring the... Uh... Our burner with the frying pan. We're gonna fry this up. A bit of okay. <laughs> Brenda, that is a great question, and I want to ask Mark this. What's that? And you guys come up with your answers to this question too, but I love it. If you chose Mortal Kombat, what would you be eating tonight? <laughs> <laughs> Scorpions? Uh, One of the arms of, um, what's his name? Gorax. Goro? Goro. We'd eat arms? No. I Maybe we would make foods that look very, like, bloody. I don't know. I don't know. Does anyone have a good idea for that? That would have kind of been fun, too. And ding, ding, Cicely, you're right. Shrimp, dried shrimp. Yes, Josie. Kim as well. Y'all are y'all are paying attention. Yeah, so yeah. usually when you make seafood pancake, there's a lot more protein, a lot more uh, seafood. But today we're making minari pancake, and we want the star, the main ingredient to be the minari. Yes, not, nothing else. So we only added little ingredients to highlight the minari. So the the dried shrimp, sweet potato, and some. Uh, Serrano pepper and red peppers. Yeah. It's like an episode of Chop, like when they put Minari in the basket, you want to make sure it doesn't get outshined by any other thing that you would put in here. So Mark's really thinking strategy tonight. Um, the only reason I'm saying that is when you went to work on the weekend, I watched like two episodes of Chop. Oh, I haven't you. watched Chopped in a while, so I was just like, felt like they were running out of contestants because they had the judges playing. I was just like, oh, more people. No, it's because of probably COVID. Oh, you're right, I guess. Uh, e Mikko says, hello, James and Mark. Thanks for being here. Again, if you are new to our channel and have not yet subscribed, please answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? And Tio says, the supporting actress speech was so good. Only good thing about the Oscars besides Glenn Close twerking. I have not seen her twerking yet, she, but I have heard about it. She did twerk for sure. Bear the Barrier would say red food for uh, Mortal Kombat or blood, crickets. Ooh, chicken yakitori skewers. <laughs> Pig feet, liver. Oh, oh, so more like the organs. Oh, intestines. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Should we do that? The thumbnail would be like me reaching out and like go chan like this. Are you guys ready for that initial sizzle? Step back a little Ooh. just in case. Oh, I should have put um. Oh, yeah. I'm going to do that now. BRB. <laughs> BRB, Minari. Oh, that looks great. Pardon me, just doing it for the Insta.
And Imiko is from Tokyo. I love you guys. Oh, sending our love to you in Tokyo as well. I would have loved oysters. I've never had cooked oysters before. Cooked oysters is hit or miss for people, I feel like. Cindy will be right back. Hannah says red meat or steak beef tartare for Mortal Kombat. Mm. That would be a great idea. Oh, raw meat yeah. beef would have been good. Yeah. Easy kaya at home and chicken parts on skewers for the fatality move. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Shelby asks, have you tried pork belly? Have we? Hmm. Have we? I feel like we've done a good handful of pork belly videos on this channel. Brenda says, I want some makgeolli now. Yes. Oh, our makgeolli came for the for the virtual tasting. Yeah, that's Thursday, right? Yeah. Loeb says, Korean pork back soup for Mortal Kombat. Tony says, okay, I missed it. What are we drinking? Well, so far we've been drinking Mountain, Mountain Dew with soju. soju. And then Mark had a little swig of uh, beer. Jay's Live says, hey, James and Mark, only been here like two weeks now, and y'all are my favorites. I have went back and looked at old videos. Oh, awesome. Thank you so much for supporting our older videos as well. We have a lot of old videos. Are they good? We're not guaranteeing anything, but it's there <laughs> for your viewing pleasure. Antonella says, hi guys, so nice to catch your live. What are you guys making? We are making a minari pancake. So minari is a Korean herb. Uh, and Mark has decided to make it in a pancake, a savory Korean pancake right now. This is um, dish one of two for tonight. This is our appetizer. Yeah. Tater cakes, missed the last 20 minutes, made sundubu jjigae for dinner. Ooh. Happy Monday, Diana. Iris, thank you also for showing us love on our old videos. I love your old videos. Regan says, James, I'm loving your hair color. Thank you. Tony is having a, a champagne and cranberry. It's called a poinsettia. That's pretty. That is very pretty. Perfect for the holidays too. Should we, um, we owe Hannah a drink. Mm, yes. Hannah, was this Brenda's? This was Brenda's. Okay, let me finish this one. Ah! What? Honestly, it's dangerous. The Mountain Dew masks all I mean, all flavor of soju. That's why I'm nervous. I'm getting my second shot tomorrow, and I can't show up all hungover. <laughs> Michael says, I keep hearing my name when you say makali. Who here has tried makali? Which is also my name too. Michael Lee, Mark Lee. <laughs> Rush Girl, you are the sweetest. I don't remember a bad video from you guys. They're all great. You know, I can think of like three. Actually, yeah, that's a good question. What's a bad... Not to be negative, Nancy, but like, what's a bad? What would you consider a bad video that we've done? Like, or even me just solo. Like the earlier ones, where you know we don't edit the same way, we don't really do things the same way. Like, those. Mm. I do. I want to rewatch that video where. Uh, remember the first, like one of the first times we went to go film somewhere. Yeah. I want to rewatch oh, that video. That was, Did we even use mic? That was awkward and a half. It's going to be hard to flip. I'm nervous for you. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were about to do it. You think I could do I it? There's something in this Mountain Dew, y'all. You think I could? Oh! <laughs> Don't do that. Oh. I'm just kidding. Something tightened here. That's not a good feeling, huh? Kim says, I used to do vodka Red Bulls when I was out clubbing. It gave me wings. <laughs> yes. Oh, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Flip it. Ah! I'm, I'm doing, 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 doing. Oh, oh no. Oh, hurry. 
Oh, okay. <gasps> wow, it's pretty. Oh, this should have been the of a movie um, poster from Minari. Minari Pancake. You know? I had no idea it was even a reference. I really thought it was like the name of the family or something. Oh, you didn't know what Minati Yeah, meant. like you could be Mark Minati, I'm James Minati, you know, like that's what I thought. Tom says they said you should not drink a day prior to the shot, really? Oh, no, no, they didn't say anything like that, as far as I know. But I'm not a medical person, so don't listen to me. Joe Zietz, you're so sweet. Reshko says we are all our own worst critic. Trust your subscribers, you are the best. You know, that's what we, well, that's what we do. We really do trust all of you, really, really, really. Tio says, any clothed video is a bad one in my eyes. That, that we've only been like, yeah, they're, not, they're all bad. <laughs> uh, Key, it is 7.06 right now. Hannah's not a big fan of rice wine. Oh, keep drinking little by little. You might get acquired to it. Yeah. It is a funky taste at first, but then now I love Makoli. Tater Kate says, uh, I'm curious what's your editing schedule? Like who does what? So Mark is more of the creative, like what are we cooking? He's the one that's like buying the ingredients and making it happen. And then I'm the one that edits. So it's a good partnership. It is, that, yeah. yeah. Stray Gat says, that looks like the onion cake served at a Korean restaurant here in SF. Like uh, Pajon, mm -hmm. green onion cake. I'm just gonna do a little sneak peek. We started the stream with five, um, let's see, five members to our membership. And we are now at 19 that's incredible again thank you everybody that has signed up to our channel membership we're so excited and we are at 100 likes so we will spin that wheel uh do you have any banchan to go with that i think mark got, i saw tofu like braised tofu was there something else too Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I do do the graphics as well, Julie. But then don't give me that much credit for the wheel because it's literally I just type it in and then it like pops up. So. All right. So I am going to share said screen while Mark gets this jiggling. All right, are we ready? Let's spin that wheel. I think there's like about three new ones on the wheel. Okay. Okay. This one is always fun. I feel like a lot of you and me too like combo and chill on yeah. Friday. So we're just doing it once tonight through the wheel and it landed on it. Yeah. So I'm going to... Pull a card at random, and if someone could type up the question, and then we're all going to answer it, if you feel comfortable. Okay, the question is, does a person's choice of religion impact your decision to date them? Does a person's choice of religion impact your decision to date them? Okay. People Again, are saying I no, love no judgment here. You are allowed to be your true self to answer the way you want, and no one's here to judge. Absolutely. Including don't judge us too. <laughs> right, oh. says, I love convo and chill. And the, the, the gas is out, but oh. I think it's not cooking anyway, so it oh, might perfect. be perfect timing. So yeah. if it's not, then blame the gas. And Lars just joined the chat. Okay, do you need help plating this? What can I do? Are you um, gonna have this? I'll just move this. 
Are you gonna keep it whole on here? Yeah, and then I'm <gasps> like a little pizza it. or a giant pizza. Oh, it's like the perfect board for that. I know, right? This board is a perfect. It's a good purchase, no? Yeah. So Josie, thank you for uh, writing that question in. Here is the pancake. I'm gonna take a picture of it as well. Okay. There's not nothing else you're doing with it, right? I can just take a picture. It's just a pancake. So again, we just made Minari pancake in homage, homage to the movie Minari. Yes. <laughs> All right. So before I read anyone's comments, yeah. How do you feel about this question? Does a person's choice of religion impact your decision to date them? No. However, if it's like, if there isn't a mutual respect for differences, then it's not gonna work out. But if you want to um, follow this religion and I don't, or I have a different religion, and we both are okay with that, that's totally fine. Mm -hmm. But if it's to the point where like, oh, I'm not going to say yes to the ring unless you convert, then that might be, that might, I don't know, that to me, that might be a deal breaker. Sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm kind of in the same uh, mindset. Like I'm, I would consider myself a spiritual person, but not religious. So if I ever encountered someone that wanted me to have the same belief systems that, as them, just because we were going to get married or date, then I probably wouldn't be able to do that mm. so. like i would still participate in like the big events or yeah. activities mm -hmm. i will of course to su support my partner but then to be at the same level of religious involvement and if i don't want to then i don't but if sure. i want to then how perfect is that yeah right yeah. but the question is not that the question is a different religion. of course so of course take that into consideration all right, so let's see what everyone said. Kim says, nah. Wait, I'm sorry. It, it Evelyn says, yes. Regan says, if they don't make me convert, no, no. Uh, Kim says, politics matters more to me than religion. Nancy says, not unless they try to push their religion on me. Absolutely. Everybody, welcome Ray to the live stream. Ray, What's thank up, you Ray? again for being a channel member. You were all vacationing and whatnot. You came back and decided to join our channel membership. That means so much to us. And get some aloe on that sunburn, girl. I am so jealous. I, I know your, to, your Insta stories I are so to much go fun. To Miami. Chris says, if you're not religious, I would say it'd be too difficult to delete, not to daily, to date a religious person. Shay Cat says, only if you're very religious. Evelyn says, yes. Alberto says, I'm in Puerto Rico now. Love from here. Got my whole family watching on the big TV. My favorite YouTube. My family love you guys. Well, hi, Alberto and family. Thank you for joining our stream. And you know what? Puerto Rico is one of the places that I, I want to go visit one day, you know? Yeah. How does this pancake look? Good. We can scoot it back a little bit more, too. Well, usually it has to be up here, but we, we have... I think I may may have done a different camera angle thing. Did you take a picture already? I did, okay. thank you. Natalie says, only if they keep trying to convert me or if their religion in the long run will prevent us from being together totally. Yeah. So kind of similar to similar to what we said, right? Yeah. Reshko says, no, I was raised Christian in the Methodist church and a Hindu man stole my heart. Michael says, if they blindly follow their religion and throw common sense out the window, then it's by Felicia. Josie says, not for me. However, my mother is strong Christian and is almost angry when my sister and I met anyone who wasn't also Christian. Like, why have hate, mm. right? Just because someone is different. Yeah. I think all religion is, it, it all comes from a place of love and wanting to love others, you know? Yeah. Like, once it becomes like to use as a leverage to not like someone, that's a, for me, like, mm -mm. no, no. No, no. Yeah. He says, definitely have to have same religious beliefs. Teresa says, absolutely. I would never date a Satanist. 
Michelle is says, "Is that a religion or is that a way of life?" I don't know. Oh, I don't know actually. Maybe it's a religion. Yeah, I did. I didn't even think about that. Michelle says it would bother me if they didn't believe in God. I don't care the religion. Ah, uh, go with the flow. If they're a completely different religion mindset, it may be conflicting. And I agree with Mark. But you know what? Take all the like the really the details and the differences aside. I want to say with all major religion, there's more commonalities than anything. Mm -hmm. It's all about how do we live our lives doing good deeds to others, how to, you know, be a better person. All those are key concepts of all major religion, you know. So if you think about it in that way, there's more that's in common than not. Mm -hmm. So that's how I like to see it. That's why I love food, because I think food brings everyone together. Great segue, right? Same with music. Oh, that's true. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at how perfect this looks. Does it look good? It yeah. Looks, it looks really, like even though it's fried, it kind of also looks healthy. Oh, here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're fine. What's this mixture of again? Just uh, soy sauce and a little bit of vinegar. Mm. We, we didn't really do anything fancy. No need. We are going to let the Minari shine. Very good. Mmm. Wow. Good. How did you get the crispness like that? Very good. I got goosebumps on my thigh. Why just there? On your thigh? Oh, it's so good. This is good, actually, because my favorite type of pancake is, is called puchu chan, which is chai pancake. Oh, there's that kick, though. Which we made before on our Lunar New Year episode. But with minari, it's good. It's really good with the minari, actually. It tastes so different from eating it raw, huh? I have a different like perspective on minari because I'm eating it this way versus the raw way. The raw way, if I had to eat it raw, I would not have survived. But this is delicious. Mm. I, I'm really appreciating the heat in this. Jackie, thank you so much. Looks amazing. Uh, no eggs were added in this. No. I'm going to turn on the air. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I'm going to turn on the air, everyone. Oh, it's so good. Okay, I'm not going to tell you guys what we're doing on Wednesday, but Wednesday was one of those videos. We filmed it yesterday, so you see it this week, but Wednesday was one of those videos where like, wow, Mark, you made that. And I'm, I'm like, just floored at how many times you can make something where you've never made it before. This I never made. I'm like, whoa, well, I was getting really nervous up until the point oh, we did so good. But if you're a member, you already know, you already have a sneak peek photo of what we're making. I'll have to watch that back, Emerita. That's sweet. It seems like Mark even surprised himself. That smile was everything. And Island Candies, we can see your comments as well. Hopefully, all those tech issues get sorted out. Mm. Mm. They should, they should, Minani pancakes should be more of a comic book because it's not as Com like the more popular one is kimchi pancake, seafood pancake, green onion pancake, yeah, even chai pancake. But minari pancake, it's not like unheard of, but it's also like not that common. But it should totally be part of the mm. top ones. Can I kiss the chef? <laughs> what? <laughs> It was really good. Mm. You did such a good job. The everything's crunchy. Even the 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 way the the use of shrimp made it crunchy. Those are crunchy bits too. You know what? It, the the crispy minati parts of the pancake. You know, sometimes when you get the really crispy leaves, outer leaves of a Brussels sprouts at a really mm. nice steakhouse restaurant, they're really like they're kind of like the yeah the outer leaves of the Brussels sprouts, or even 
like some kale chips when you make it and it has that like some kind of interesting umami flavor i think the minari has that in here mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. would you consider it bitter or sweet well if you eat minari raw it's more bitter think of a herb all herbs especially when you eat them raw tend to be on the bitter side yeah right mm -hmm. um but when you cook it, it that's when it totally changes like sailor moon where they like do the whole like transformation to their you know superhero outfit or power rangers you know it's morphin time minari totally morphed mm. I like things that has a little like spice kick to it. So that's why uh, we added uh, some serrano pepper and red pepper. I mean, the, the addition of that kind of makes me feel like Minetti is trying to be like arugula. <laughs> <laughs> but I know, but there is a, there is that, hmm, what is that like taste that is only achieved by yeah. the Minetti, so. So watercrust to my understanding is uh, similar, but a little bit different. The leaves are like, they kind of look more like kale leaves. Uh, Minari leaves look more like parsley leaves. So, oh yeah. So uh, watercress, although it looks very similar, it might be slightly different. I'm sure you could even do watercress pancake. I'm sure that would be good. But this in English, the three names that I've seen at the market is called drop wort, mm -hmm. water parsley, or water celery. Those are the three kind of most common names I've seen in English. So again, not to give you a spoiler about the movie, but Minari has a symbolic place in the storyline for the qualities that it has as a plant or a, a, a herb. So I was nerding out because after the movie, I wanted to read more mm. about why is this movie called this? What's the significance? And after I read the commentary on that, it made a lot more sense. So. Mm. Oh, I forgot that there's sweet potato in here. That makes sense. I don't even really notice it, huh? I think it, it gets masked with the batter. Mm -hmm. But I would still include it either way, because I feel like you created something that really works. Maybe instead of sweet potato, you could even use potato. That would work too. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Is it anything like water morning glory, which I don't know what that is. I felt like when I read it, that was referenced, but I'm not sure. Oh. Not sure. <laughs> like yeah. when I ate it, it maybe like so good. Parsley, maybe? I don't know. Chris says, I've heard people ask for Minari in my local health food store and the clerks look confused. You probably need to go with the English name then. Was it easy to find at the market for you? It's oh, Korean. It, it's, I, I think it's a lot of, it's popular in Asian markets, but especially uh, Korean folks, they love Minari. They add that to a lot of stews and soups and stuff as a topping. So... They say there's medicinal benefits in eating it, but who knows? I feel a lot better eating this, actually. Oh, good, because you said your condition wasn't... <laughs> no, I feel said. very reinvigorated. Oh, like, good. Mm. Is that a hollow veggie? I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm curious. Who here right now has seen the movie Minari? Oh yeah, who has seen yeah, it? Who's seen it? Again, it's not a blockbuster movie. Um, I hope I'm not giving it away. If you're thinking it's going to be like Parasite, no, it's it's totally different type of movie, different style, different. I don't know, like vibe, per vibe and purpose. So it's not Parasite. 
But like Parasite, it really touches upon um, kind of like real life like challenges that people have, you mm -hmm. know? So I think that's why it's so great. Julie, it is not the same as water spinach that Kim Tai eats by the pound. No, it's totally different. Water celery is not this, right? That's different. No, this is oh. water cel water celery, water parsley, or water dropwort. Dropwort. Drop so then island candies, yes, it's very common at Korean markets. I'm sure all the Minati farmers are like oh, great. Yeah, great free marketing for it's them. It's like free PR for them, you know. Love it. We should finish the last, the last one. I already ate half. You can have the last one. I we're we're gonna make our next dish. You don't have to ask me twice. It was so good. I kind of wish we had beer. Oh, do you want beer? Yeah, I want a beer with this. Oh, won't our next dish be perfect with beer too? That would be good with beer. So. I want beer, guys. No, it's not the chrysanthemum greens and hot pot. Totally different. Oh, we had a bambu. Are those not the, those are different from the tasting ones, yeah, right? this is not the tasting one. Mm. This was all the way in the back. So we have. Oh, do you want to bite Yay. before you drink to get a drink? No, I'm going to have it. Yeah, we have makgeolli that we could drink tonight. No, take a bite. That's what Brenda would want. I already dipped it, so it's dipped here. Because <laughs> earlier when you were making it, she's like, oh, I really want makgeolli now. So Brenda, this one was for you there. Mm. Oh, shoot, I forgot to shake it. Shake it, shake it. Mm. Um. Do you need me to bring the burner back? Yep. Oh, oh you're having a moment. Makgeolli and chans. It's like, I mean, this beer is going to be so good. Oh, beer would be good too. Okay, oh. taking that drink, I felt like I was at the creek harvesting it and putting it in my basket. <laughs> not when, uh, it's not like when you have to drink pee. Oh no, <laughs> spoiler alert, you got something on your lips. Got it? Let me check. If you didn't get it, I get it with my lips. Are you okay? I made sure I wiped down really well. <laughs> Is that a joke mm. to you? Not like loving me? I don't love you. Oh, we need another burner, huh? Oh yeah, I I, I brought out the can. And then- let's um, set this first, however you want. And then let's just use the same frying pan, less dishes. It might oh, have God. it might have residual flavor of the Minari pancake, which I think would be awesome, and actually. Yeah, we not need to this stuff too. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. oh, so chill vibes today, guys. Chill vibes. Oh wait, how do you open this again? It's open. camera <laughs> that was close that was super close Did I not? do you push it in all the way maybe it's not. magnetic there we go Jessica, welcome to the live stream.
Uh, we are not done eating. We are making dish number two of the evening. We just had our appetizer of minari pancake. And then now we're going to stir fry um, this already prepped uh, small octopus in spicy marinated sauce. Can I take a picture of you holding it so I can send it to our friends at Soul Mills? One, two, three. Okay. So close. And we got a super chat from Jane. Oh, Minari. Oh, Jane, you missed totally Mr. Minari John. It was so good, Jane. Oh, oh sorry. I'm sorry. I'm yeah. Sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. Jane, Jane, Jane thank you. We appreciate you. Oh, cheers. Minari. I'm almost done with my beer. That's how good that pancake was. And that was just only one. You only had it with one slice. Yeah. Tater Cake says, James and Mark Buzz is the best. Who else agrees? Okay, Mark is adding some green onion to the pan. And James says, cute shirt, Mark. Corn sauce. Love says, are you adding Minari? I don't believe so. Tim says we should do a live drinking game. You know what? There's been waves of different types of drinking games on this channel. Do you remember that one stream where there was like, I don't know, five people and we were just all taking shots? Like on, on the live. Oh, yeah. So it happened. You just have to come to all the videos because you just don't know when it'll happen. Jessica, we have put our uh, crowns away for now, but you never know when they'll make another appearance. We just want to keep everyone on their toes. Yes. Julie says, do or drink game. Yes, we still got to play that. Speaking of which, uh, I haven't done the siren in a while. So if I get 15 people to drop the siren emoji in the chat, I will do a complimentary siren. Okay. So any, any of you who wear headphones to watch us, take them off now. Or maybe James should... Drink another uh, big glass of Mountain Dew so that caffeine could really amplify. You, are you going to handle the hyper me? Amplify. You can barely the handle the normal me. You want the hyper me? I was hyper yesterday, wasn't I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hedy, where is he? I think he's in the uh, bedroom. Michelle, this is a hex clad pan. Drinking games are always going on, right, Tony? They are. Tipolo Grant is 7.33 p.m. Let's see. How many? I don't even remember how many uh, sirens I said I needed. I'm going to count. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Great use of the emojis, by the way, Michael. Seven. Yeah, we only got seven. So there, there's no... Uh, siren uh, going off yet. Dan, welcome to the live stream. Do you ever repeat your t-shirt? Seems like you guys always have a new one on every time. Uh, we do. I wore, I've worn this a couple times. This one is fairly new. And then yesterday, I just bought three new t-shirts. So you'll be seeing that in the next series of my books. I really like all of them. Ooh, Regan. Hey, why don't we, we should talk, we'll start a thread in the community uh tab and talk about drag race there in case people haven't watched it we got i got spoiled on it accidentally on um tiktok so i don't know if i would have felt the same way but yeah we should we should totally talk about it some more or on discord all right how many how many okay i'm gonna say seven eight i'm confused i felt like julie did it earlier already mark's adding cabbage now Nine, ten. Okay, we need five more, but it looks like we have to spin the wheel, so let's get to that order of business okay. first. So don't ever let me do it. All right, you guys ready? We are gonna spin this wheel. Spin that wheel. 
Uh oh, Minati Kiss. What? So this was your idea. How does this one work? Minati Kiss. Wait, what is that? Actually, I don't mind. It's a kiss. I'll take it. Eddie wrote fine and did a uh, siren. I'm so sorry. That took so much effort on your part. So I'm going to change it to 125. We're going to get to the Minati kiss. Yes. All right, so Minati kiss, uh, each one of us will get one end of the Minati stem, and then we have to meet in the middle. But do we have to eat it? One is the stem. Oh, this is better raw, remember? One is a stem and one's a leaf part. So wouldn't you all choose who gets what end? You all get to choose who gets what end. Okay, so far, Kasha says James gets the leaf. Chantal hates me and says James, Sam, Mark leaves. Leaf for James. Another siren. I think we're up to 12. We need three more sirens before oh, I pop off. It Ooh. comes in a package like this. Yeah. Okay, so I need scissors. Josie says bigger mouth. That's why she used her logic. Leaf for James. James then, Mark leaves, so it sounds like a three to two thing. Mark leaves, now it's three to three. We got, I think we need one more siren. Thank you for the additional siren. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, oh, low rules, and I'm gonna take Jessica's siren because her phone don't have a siren, but she still wrote my siren and I love that. Okay. Ingenuity there, okay, you guys ready? One, two, three. That's the Mountain Dew speaking right there. I feel like the mountains heard me, and now all the water that was stored up has been released. You know? Kim, next next stream, find the siren emoji. It's a, it's a must here. All right, so James Lee, James Lee. Oh, that's like my name. Oh, <laughs> James Lee. All right, it sounds like I get Lee and you get the stem. But I don't, honestly, either end for me is uh, bad. Oh, I'm so sorry, Marianne. That scared my BF, he's driving, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Be safe, guys, I'm so sorry. I thought, did warn people. He probably thought it was a real siren. What if he, what if he pulled over to the side oh and it was God. like, oh, there was someone coming. Oh, I'm so sorry. My apologies sent to your BF. So we'll do two packages. Mark, add some Minari to your octopus. Perhaps. Perhaps. Yeah, if anyone wants to add insight for Diana's question, uh, I'm getting my second Pfizer shot and I'm really anxious anyone had theirs yet. Uh, no, when Hedu hears a siren, he knows to like hide. Oh no, Mike Porto says my dog was wigging out. Oops. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, Mikey, this is uh, marinated octopus. It's actually, uh, here, let me, what's it? It's in a spicy sauce and we're making. So, ooh, this is the, it's, it's the, it's the miniature octopus. There mm. is a species. It's not a baby octopus because I looked it up. Um, it's called jukumi uh, in Korean, um, which is they actually this size. This is the tentacles, and this is the body part right here. Oh no, Kim says my Shiva just Shiva screamed <laughs> at each other. <laughs> Maybe that should be a punishment on the wheel. Just James does a siren for like thirty seconds or something. 
Sorry, y'all. It sounds like it caused a lot of commotion, unintended. Oh, this is, I, the sauce smells good. Yeah. I wonder if this is the spicy kind. It looks spicy. Oh, it's been marinated for 36 hours. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tony says, Mark, can't believe you're eating octopus after the octopus teacher. Which, you know what? I'm so happy that they won the documentary at the Oscars. They deserve it. Although, um, a lot of the movie critics did say that the other documentaries are probably more deserving. Mm. But I haven't seen those. So I only know, out of all the movies that were nominated, I actually only seen Octopus My Teacher. So when they won, I was happy. Yeah. Foxy Brown Babe says, hey, 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 welcome to the live stream. Oh, oh I love Foxy Brown. <laughs> that was a cool show back in the 70s, I think. And we have a new channel member, Latanya Watts. Thank you so much oh for gosh. joining our channel membership. We so appreciate you Thank and you. hope you enjoy your French fry badge. So what we'll do for this stir fry is um, let's top it off with some cheese. Ooh, cheese, y'all. And then um, if you want rice now, we could eat it with rice. Or after we eat, eat some, we yeah. could with the leftover sauce, we could make fried rice. Number two, number two. You want to do number two? Number two, okay. yeah. Not that number two, but number two. Okay, just number two. Remember that one live where James <laughs> yeah! had to excuse himself twice during a live? <laughs> I don't remember that. I oh, don't remember okay. that. Did that happen this month? It happened recently. Hey, I was still uh, chatting in the chat. <laughs> Just wasn't here. Happy Monday to you as well, Bic. Welcome to the live stream. Tony says, chummy, chummy, chummy. Well, using the chummy emojis. Love the special emojis. So all of our uh, new channel members, uh, I'll leave a post in our community tab that you guys will see so you can suggest the additional emojis that now we have access to. But they have to be things I can actually like design or create. I feel like my face one should be changed to this like a screaming thing. Yeah. What would you, what you, and we need to think of one for you that's like specific to I, you. I don't know. You know what I mean? Elvis says the poop live happened last week. Now, first of all, let's not call it poop live. We're trying to get people to watch the stream, Elda. Just kidding. All right, Mark is adding the cheese. And you'll be like, why is only half Bill? Well, you know what? We have another bag of cheese. And are you asking the brand of the, the octopus or something else? If, if it's the octopus, I can send you a picture at some point. And the link if you do want to get it online. Yes. Great, Diana. I hope that puts you at ease. And I'm getting my second shot very soon. So we're in this together. Taste test? Mm. Sure. Kim says you need a soju emoji. You know, I was thinking of that too. Oh, that's cute, Rush Girl. Mark's emoji should be a black glove holding chopsticks. I like that, but how would we fit all that in that small frame? Hannah says, please send through Discord. I will absolutely do that for you, Hannah. Uh oh, my camera turned off. No, 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 you're fine. Tony says we need a 600 rice cooker emoji, and then it'll stay there until we actually use it, and then that will retire the $600 rice cooker emoji. I like that. Uh, Can we do that? 
keep keep all your ideas fresh up here. We're gonna reach out for feedback. Speaking of which, Tater Cakes, thank you so much for joining our channel membership. Oh my gosh. We are so appreciative. I think we cracked the 20, the 20 channel members. I had no expectation <laughs> Excuse me. whatsoever. We have, we have 20 members. Over 20 now, I think. 21, lucky oh 21. Gosh. I love 21. Thank you so much again, Tater Cakes. We really appreciate it. Oh, Hannah, yeah, we, we, we got to get on that. When will you be making merch? I would so buy it. We will let you know. You will be the first person to know. You know, this add more cheese. Oh, yeah. All right, Ray says, people are asking how to get the channel membership. So all you need to do is underneath this video or any of the other video, like on our main page, you'll see a button that says join. Yeah, doing the empty spots. So all you need to do is click on the join button, and then it'll walk you through how to process payment, and then you should be all set. I think that's how it works, right? Let me see if I could even pull it up on here. I don't know what it looks like if you're actually in the video, but I can at least show you from the main home page what it will look like. I mean, I guess I could test it here. Wait, let me just double check and see. I don't know. Hopefully there's not an echo. Oh, okay, so it's on here. That's weird. <laughs> Okay, so let me share that screen. Oh, we're fro <laughs> We're not frozen. We're not but... frozen. Okay, so like on the video, this is on desktop, so I'm not sure what it looks like on your phone. Your phone, but there's a button here that says join. You can just click on that mm. and it'll pop up this window. You'll see a little uh trailer talking about it here are all the badges here's the emojis that you get and there is a very very short video that explains it you just click on this button sorry if there's an echo and that's that's pretty much all it takes to sign up yeah pretty easy youtube makes it easy yeah right all right i think it's done Ooh. and ray thank you for the heads up We do have so many different merch ideas, wouldn't we? <laughs> Tony says merch needed now since we have channel membership, right? We can we can get cracking on it sooner rather than later. His membership has James been floating this idea for a while. We just got around to it, you know. Yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. And one more photo, and then I will get out of your hair. Okay. All right, let's try. so good. Try this cheesy, spicy octopus. It's gonna be a hot time. Yeah, I'm gonna probably let it rest for a sec. Oh. Oh, Mikey is a member. Mikey, thank you so much. Oh, that's a cute profile pic, by the way. For the channel membership. Okay, so we got some competition because I know Mikey is part of some like wine membership clubs. We gotta be more lit than them. Uh, we'll, so they be sending her wine, we'll, so we gotta be doing. We'll send you chunks or something. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for joining. Oh. You are part of the founding members club. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, Julie, thank you so much Whoa. for signing up as well. Oh my gosh, Julie, thank you. I know camper season is upon us. We're not going to see Julie on Fridays anymore. So we still really appreciate you being a member so that when you leave comments, everyone can see how much you really love us. <laughs> you already love us without it. So, but thank you for Maybe it. one of the emojis could be canned potatoes. <laughs> Maybe that would like, be fun. Maybe the members could suggest what we cook. Oh yeah, and that Julie might be like use canned potato. Ooh yeah, that could be interesting. Okay, this is good for something that we didn't have to prep or marinate ourselves. It tastes pretty legit. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Nice chewy. 
Mm. Ooh, spicy. <clears throat> oh, the cheese kind of makes it special. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's spicy. Not spicy. It's a perfect level of spiciness. Island Candies, I don't know if this is a uh, autocorrect. I know you guys met at Auckland. Where's Auckland? Is that in Australia? <laughs> but who asked who on the first date and where did you guys go on the first date? Was there even an asking? It just kind of happened, no? Kind of just happened, but probably one of, one of our first dates, we went to Cape Town in LA. Yeah. And we did, we had really good food and dessert so i had a fun time mm-hmm. and james didn't um really get to hang out in k-town that much at that time so forever was, was it ever mm-hmm. i never went there so it was probably new and exciting for you huh kim says i love your camping videos thank you we could probably freeze one of these bags and bring it with us and make this dish there. Well, it comes to us frozen for yeah. whole meals and you just need to easily defrost them in the fridge and then just cook it. Yeah. We just made it a little bit special by stir frying some cabbage, onions, green onions, and carrots first, but you really don't need to. But usually with a dish like this, if you order at a current restaurant, it usually has those vegetables in it. So we wanted to do that and then top it off with some cheese we're using a mexican blend cheese want some rice <laughs> not yet i don't think i'll need rice until the, the other part but it's spicy and you didn't add any additional spice mikey says james i dropped off the goods in your office don't forget it when you go in i'm going to set a reminder after this stream is over can you remind me mm. be like pick up goods <laughs> What what are goods? <laughs> Sandra says, hi guys, love from Michigan. Hi. Thanks for being here. Tony thinks that members should choose drinks. That'd be fun. Like a, your favorite cocktail when you make it. Yeah. Oh, and Auckland is New Zealand, not Australia. Thanks, Mike, for that. Mm, I think even adding tteokbokki would be good. Mm-hmm. Kim, I'm going to tease you. They ask, who has a better spice tolerance? That's how I know she's newer to our channel. You will find out very soon. <laughs> or like right now. <laughs> Austin says that spice is giving James a nice glow or are you working on your tan? Definitely not working on my tan because I've not been going out, but I feel like my lighter hair makes me uh, look darker. Oh, huh, yeah. Right? Yeah. That's my theory. Or when your face turns red, it's more noticeable. I'm turning red. No, but remember when we, when we went to uh, Habuya and we started drinking the sake, Mayumi is like, oh my God, James is turning red. And we're like, we only had one shot of sake at that point or something like that. That's very, very true. Very true. Uh, I'm not sweating quite yet, but it's getting there. It's getting there. And yes, Tom and uh, his fiance, Sean, have already moved. We miss them sorely. Yeah. Someone asked if we could do a cheese pull. Is that possible? Um, Let's see. Mark has the greatest chance of doing with this pull right here. Just one. That was just one pull. You kind of have to like really dig it in, you know? Yeah. 
Our friends watched Demon Slayer in the movie theater and they really enjoyed it. 10 out of 10. I've never heard of it. It's an anime, I think. Oh, is it? Kara Jade, welcome to the live stream. Hello, my handsome. Sorry so late. No worries. Never need to apologize. Oh, we have tofu side dish. Do you want? Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's grab that. And then we have boy Do you think that would help? Whatever you think, girl, because I'm struggling right now. So James is like, pick up a couple of side dishes when you're in the market. So we have some um, fried chicken. Yes. We have oi, um, what is this? Uh, cucumber kimchi. And then this, uh, we don't buy that often, but I don't mind it at all. It's the uh, dried anchovy that's stir fried in like a sweet glaze. There's a reason why I got this. Mmm, what? Do you remember? In the movie Minari, uh, the oh, she brings all it. Excited about oh yes. my god, Miyuchi, you brought anchovies from Korea. So, um, to kind of be on theme of today's episode, I wanted to pick up this. Oh, Linda, thanks for the boost of confidence, James. You're such a trooper to hang with Mark's spice level, right? Austin says, Do I go on Discord to see if you're all on there? But no one has been on when I get on, and race is the same thing. But then there was this one night when me and Julie were talking until like two in the morning. We're talking about states that have populations of people that go missing the most. What? That's so <laughs> but we're not allowed to talk about what happens on Discord. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, you don't need to reveal it because what what gets talked on Discord stays on Discord, but does it happen to be a state where Julie resides? In? No, but she's considering living there. I wouldn't be surprised. Mm, Maggie says she needs to get cucumber kimchi. You know what? This is a great question. Following up to Mikey's comment. What's your guys' favorite banchan or Korean side dishes? Drop it in the chat. And we do have an H Mart near us. Yes. Mm. You know, I'm actually really impressed with this prepackaged uh, spicy octopus. If you want to see the packages right here. Usually for something that's already prepped and prepackaged for you, it's not as spicy. You know, they don't make it as spicy or whatever, but this brand knows how much spice to add. Yeah. Right? Fire. It's fire, y'all. Like good and fire. You know what I mean? Look how red it is. Well, we're going to make fried rice. <laughs> fried or fired? Ooh, now I'm just playing with the cheese. And just let it sit off to the side. Ebony Cotton, we are having stir fried, stir -fried spicy. spicy octopus. And if you're interested, okay, I, I guess we need to say this. Um, we actually have a special promo code that if you use the word James and Mark, on Soul Mills, you actually get 10% off. And this dish is actually from there. Yeah, if one of the mods can type that in the chat, S-E-O-U-L-M-I-L-L-S.com. That's where we got all the food. Josie says acorn jelly, fave. That's one of my favorite too. It's so simple and the texture is so like unique. Low bro says bachelor kimchi. Mm, Tonga kimchi. Josie also says corn cheese. Ray says anything kimchi. Kim says spadish, spadish, spicy radish kimchi. <laughs> uh, Mike says kenip changachi and changjorim. Wow, that's really like Korean. What's changjorim? 
is the the meat that's kind of like a patty. Oh, it's um kind of been marinated in like a soy based sauce, and then you you could you technically eat it cold, but it's kind of salty like soy saucy. You've had it before. This beef. <laughs> I'll take a look at a picture, and I'm sure I'll remember. Radish kimchi for Julie as well. Mrs. B says, where did Sean and Tom move? They are in the Pacific Northwest now, and the videos are gone on their page? I don't believe so, but I haven't checked in a while, so I don't know if they took them down. But I, I don't think so. they're gone no. on the YouTube, yeah. Yeah. Hi, Jamie. Welcome to the live stream. Mabel says, kimchi, seaweed, and radish with onion and jalapeno. Mm. Uh, oh, soy sauce braised beef. Hannah asks, do you guys watch Hany mukbang? Of course we watch Hany's mukbangs. We love her. Pre-COVID, we we was a, we're, we're able to hang out with her a couple of times, and that was a lot of fun. Mayflower says, cucumber kimchi is my favorite. Okay, just because you said there, that, I'm going to take a bite. There's more than enough for everybody here. Oh, sure, we still need to do the Minari kiss. Oh crap, I forgot about that. Let's do that, that now because we're gonna forget. No one remember. Yeah, you guys we should have like gone without No it. one remember. I I just looked glanced in the corner. I was like, wait, why is there a Minati still? I don't want to do this. It's gonna ruin everything. Wait, hold on, we got a super chat. Huh? Let's like now I was like Oh, we got a super sticker from Ebony. Thank oh you so gosh. much for the twenty dollar super sticker. Thank you. Wow. All right, oh, ready? Yeah. Ebony, Ebony, thank you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much for that super chat. Oh, we so you. appreciate it. Uh, you just came in time for us to do this Minari kiss. Because we landed on the wheel. So who's doing this leaf side? I think they said me because I have a bigger <laughs> mouth. I don't know. You ready? How much? And I have to eat it? We and we have to, to kiss? We have too? to meet in the middle. Okay, ready? Uh-huh. Oh, you don't want to leave. <laughs> right? Okay. Mm. Mm. Mm, I don't like it raw. Eat this. Ow! Hey, what'd you do? <laughs> I don't like this. Me not eat. <laughs> Wait! Baby, you got to kiss me, though. No, that ruined the kiss. <laughs> it's bitter. It's like eating raw parsley. That's exactly what it tastes like to me. Like, the stem is like a parsley stem. I don't know what the leaves were like, but the stem tastes like a parsley stem. I don't know why, but... As we were like eating it and moving towards each other, I felt like livestock. Like I felt like I was uh, like, you know, like horses, do they eat carrots or what do they eat? Hey. I don't know. I, like whatever animal eats the thing that has all the leaf, I felt like that. Oh, like a rabbit too? I didn't like it. What's makjang? Usually makjang means like a type of sauce that you could use for a lot of things. Mm. Ooh. Hi, Peek Boo. Welcome to the live stream. We got Kevin here saying, hey, hey, happy Monday to my favorite couple in Mukbanger. Oh. Let me know when you're ready for the fried rice, but we might have to put more like um set aside like maybe half of it for the mm. fried rice but let me just cook the rice now right? how are we on with the light goals y'all I feel like we didn't do a lot of wheel spins today. 
It just feels that way. Mm. Oh, if we had some rice cake, it would have been so delicious in here. Technically, we do. Or did we talk? Or did we not? Did we use it all up after that shabu one? The one filled with cheese. Oh, that was our premium ingredient. I don't remember what we, we did. should still have some because I know we didn't use it all. Whew. Can you read Tiho's comment? Did we make anything with anything with toyang gochu? Which to me, toyang gochu is very similar to serrano pepper. Mm. But uh, even in the even in California at the current market, they don't carry the uh, the uh, uh, yang gochu all the time. So for me, a good replacement is serrano pepper. And when we made the minari pancake earlier tonight, we added serrano pepper to that. Mm. <clears throat> Kim, I don't know if Mark would be able to answer this. Who are your favorite K-pop group and your biases from them? Who's your favorite from Son Yoshide? I always liked, um, well, I first liked Tiffany. Do you know why? No. She was in this one, like, very, like, internet-based, like, music program that she hosted with another person. Before Girls' Generation or during? Like, in the earlier days of Girls' Generation. Mm. But it wasn't a popular music. It, I, I want to say it was just internet-based. So it looks like, and the set of production, it just looks like they're in a bedroom with a webcam. You know, that kind of vibe. So I was like, that's how I got to know Tiffany. Mm. But then, then I started to like, um, is her name Suyong? Suyong? Yeah, I like Suyong too. I like Hyoyeon. Even though like technically she's not the most popular, but I wasn't based upon popularity. Okay, so let's let's this let's set aside maybe half of that away. Uh, okay. And I need a bowl, right? Or am I putting it? Wait, what am I putting it in? Oh, okay. uh. Eddie says Tiffany always messed up the dance to O, and it bothered me so much. I'm gonna have to rewatch that. I mean, there's compilations of her messing up dances, but that never really bothered me that much. So as Mark instructed, ah, my tongue is on fire. Sorry. My tongue is on fire. Me naughty. Kiss her hand. More? No, this is oh, perfect, perfect. Okay. Set this aside. I'm just Set this aside. Fried rice one more time. James is glowing. Hi, Pink Cat. Welcome to the live stream. And Hyoyeon was the best dancer of the group, right? She was a good dancer. Decent. Decent. Fried rice. Again, if you guys have not yet subscribed to our channel, hit that subscribe button. Answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Yes. yes. Us. So we are making fried rice right now. If you just joined the stream, we've already, this is going to be the third dish technically of tonight. You nope. made three things. No wonder I'm kind of getting full. I was like, why am I full already? But yeah, this is our third dish. All right. And we have open invitation to spin the wheel. We just hit 150. Nice. Thank you guys for liking this video. And we're going to spin it right now. Uh, nothing could be worse than Minati because I knew that was going to be the worst one, right? It wasn't that bad. 
I didn't like it. I, well, I didn't get to leave them. <laughs> but plus, plus, like, I'm sure you're more like acclimated to Minari type taste. Like, this is like the first Minari really. I don't eat had. Minari raw. You act like I. My mom fed me that as a baby. Well, you know, sweet potato was fine. I don't know. Minari probably would have been okay too. Oh, the raw potato. Raw potato, right? Okay, ready? All right, let's spin that wheel. Uh oh, banishment uh -oh. for five minutes. All right, so this is how it's gonna work. We're gonna play rock, paper, scissors, and the person that loses two out of three will be banished for five minutes. And we should just do it now, okay. just to make it exciting. Okay, okay ready? Rock, rock, paper, scissors. scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. I'm banished. Okay. Oh no, oh no, okay. Alexa, set timer for five minutes. Okay. Coach me, boo. Lower the heat as much as possible. We're gonna burn it. I don't want to be by myself. All by myself. Don't want to be all by myself. Cooking fried rice. Mark, I need help. Don't want to burn all this fried rice anymore. Am I mixing it too much? Hello, Mark. What do I do? I don't like this choice on the wheel. Well, yeah, me either. It's stressful. He's not doing anything. Taeyang is my only Korean crush. Yes. When he sang that wedding dress song, I was like, I'll put on that wedding dress and I'll take it off for you. Just turn off the heat. Are you serious? I'm not going to turn off the heat. The show must go on. Geronimo says, Minari, I want to see it. Yes. We've been using Minari all night. Now we're making fried rice. This doesn't seem right. It's like a risotto. I thought it was supposed to be fried rice. Take a cold shower right now. Spread it into one thin layer. All right, Kmu is giving me instructions. Listen to Kmu. <laughs> Brave girls, you ready? T G E. Na 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 na, baby. Korean fried rice is wet, but with burnt layer on bottom. Got it. I wanna you. There's a part where it's like beating. Just spread a thin layer and cook. Okay. I'm probably annoying Mark right now. <laughs> oh, mix, 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 mix. Okay. How long? This is five minutes taking forever. <gasps> Julie, uh, Kai makes me want to be all bendy and ish. What? I need to give this guy another closer look. He, they always give him the most like revealing outfits, I feel like. Okay, the, I'm, I'm cooking the heat right now. Add sesame oil, then mix. Sesame oil. <gasps> There's two bottles that look exactly the same. That's my sesame oil. Okay, this one actually says sesame oil. Let me smell it. Okay, should I turn on turn on the heat a little bit more? It's not, it's still wet. So I shouldn't add this yet, right? I want to mark the light goal. <laughs> 
There we go. There we go. Add. Okay, add. I'm just going to do two little. I just cranked up the heat yet a little bit more because it wasn't cooking as much. Alexa, how much more time? 30 seconds. Get ready, boo. Get ready to salvage this worst cook in America episode. This is where I do my confessional where I cry and I was like, it's just fried rice. Everyone's yelling at me in the chat. Just kidding. Okay, Mark's gonna handle this situation. I don't think I did anything in the five minutes, to be honest. How many spoonfuls was I supposed to do? I did it based on feeling. Isn't that how cooking works? Alexa off, Mark, come back. Yeah, you had enough. Samuel. The first round? And a little extra, so okay too. You you basically told me to turn it off. How'd I do? Good, very good. He's just being nice. Oh, this is really red. I feel like it's still gonna be super spicy. Risotto style, right? For sure, this is gonna be risotto style. I can already tell. It's okay. It's okay. We're all in this together, y'all. How is a banishment? It's okay. Y'all, I'm challenging you all right now. Let's get to 200 likes by the end of the stream. We can make it happen. We didn't think we would have anyone sign up to our channel membership. Look what happened to that. I think we can hit 200 likes. So keep liking this video. I think we have one or two more Minari related wheel spins. So it's unfortunate we haven't landed on them. This is good. <clears throat> add cheese to the sauce. Should we add more cheese? If you want. No. There's already a lot of like melted cheese in between yeah, the sauce, yeah. but if you want to add a layer, that's totally fine. Okay. Add, add a small uh, layer of something. We're we also going to add some gimzaban. <laughs> Just a little bit. Yeah. What do you need me to? I'm not gonna bring the lid. Usually the lid is needed to oh. melt the cheese, but this it should be fine. <laughs> Tio says, I want to see another Minari kiss. I don't know if that was worse or the egg kiss, to be honest. What do you think was worse? The egg kiss was worse. See? Sorry, I'm scooting my chair. <sighs> spicy. Spicy but good spicy. I haven't had a good spice in a while, if I think about it. This can be a temperature hot. Yeah, so we have to let it chill anyways, no? Let, like, yeah, let's let, let it, it. Let's let it chill. Can't dig bit. into it right away. You're gonna burn my tongue. Well, that's chilling. I'm gonna. Oh, I, as a kid, this was one of my favorite side dish. Tubu chorin. Tubu chorin. 안녕하세요. 저는 부부 조리 조림입니다. 조림입니다. 사랑해요. I need to learn more Korean words. Hi, Jonna. Welcome to the live stream. Ray, thank you for the encouraging words. You were still being a champ and kept going in on it. And Hannah says, do you guys have Japanese mayo? We do. Oh, this is like... 
basically eating like a popsicle right now relative to, to the heat of this this is like oh we forgot to pick up big stick ice cream do we have time to go to the market after this maybe someone yeah. said to pick up um a lot of well we have a lot of water but pick up gatorade and we have Tylenol already right <laughs> Where was all this like energy when I got my second? Drink? No one, no one warned us. No one warned us. Yeah. Everyone else, I I had one of the worst reaction. I was out of fever up to almost one hundred and four degrees. Body ache, body chills. I couldn't sleep that night. Maybe one hour max because I was my body was hurting so much. I know I kept tossing and turning all throughout the night. I slept like a doll that night. I should have been more concerned that maybe you would have not been that comfortable. Um, no additional spice was added, Foxy Brown. This was with the... Um, but it's still... Sauce. Even adding a bowl of rice, it still looks really red. I have a feeling it's going to be still spicy. I'm going to scoop some on my plate so it has time to like cool down. Yeah. Julie says, I'm Korean and I only know kimchi for a Korean word. <laughs> if you get a headache, just hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Got it. Oh, right. The night that you were really sick was the night I chatted with Julie really late. Because I kept going in the room checking on you and I was even on Discord saying, Julie, can you give me a second? <laughs> and I think I forgot to mute, and all she heard was, uh... You heard me moan? I was I'm just so kidding. miserable. Oh, this is really good. I love this. I love this. More than especially me? Calm with, down. Especially with the seaweed topping. Oh my gosh, this is good. Ray, were you Pfizer or Moderna? He was Pfizer. Oh, okay. So I haven't heard anyone get really sick with Pfizer, but I also haven't done like a formal poll either, so don't trust that. But <clears throat> I heard that everyone just has a different reaction. It doesn't mean one thing or the other. It's just yeah. Oh. Mm. Oh, lunchtime mukbang this week. I don't know if we're going to do that or not. But if we did, it would either be Tuesday or Thursday. And Tuesday seems like a crap shoot because I have no idea how I'm going to feel. Well, it wouldn't happen right away. No, I I felt it literally nine hours, exactly nine hours after the shot. Oh, it's spicy still, girl. This is so good. Oh, I made it well. Mm hmm. Everyone said I added too much sesame oil, though. Ooh, was it not enough? No, it was perfect. See, I know how to cook for my man. Dope, but if you're going to add more, I was going to be like, no! Sesame oil has its little go a long way, really. Yeah, Dana is right. That's what I heard too, that if you do get a reaction from it, it means that your body is trying to fight off what it thinks that your body has, like the COVID-19. So that means that if I get the virus, like my body's already like, oh, we know exactly what to do, so we don't really need a rack anymore. I need, I'm going to get cold water. Is that okay? Yeah. Oh, look. Oh, wait. Oh, you already saw. Look at what animals on the TV. Oh, penguins. Okay, Moo, if you want us to send you some, uh, let us know. But it's actually not bad at all for a pre-packaged thing. Now, you... The octopus is for sure not cooked, so you have to cook it. But in terms of like not having to deal with making the sauce, not even that. 
sometimes when you buy um, chukumi from the market, you have to prep it. You have to rinse it. You have to wash it in salt water. Like there's a lot of like prep time and you have to like cut the body from the legs like you know yeah but this has already been like you just throw it in a pan linda says loving james's spicy face do you do you really how many tricks can Hedy do at least five About five Fossey Brown's answering a question from Chicago. Loves all seafood and subscribe subscribed years ago. Oh. If you want to add more seaweed, I think that really helps with the spiciness too. Have we seen this octopus at uh, H Mart? I don't. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have. Mm -hmm. I made it once for a mukbang. Oh, do you remember? Mm -mm. And we actually made fried rice afterwards. Mm. But we actually bought the octopus from the seafood section of H Mart. <clears throat> Welcome, explore as we go. Thanks for dropping by from Bali and loving your hair. Thank you so much. I know, Mark has aged me horribly. <clears throat> no, I made you hip and young. <sighs> I wanna eat more. Hey, this is my last part. You can have the rest. Because I, <coughs> I know I have more than half of the rice just right now. So. I'm yeah, gonna... you did. Just enjoy. Who cares? This is really good. And my favorite part of the meal is the, is the rice part. You're fine. I ate a full big-ass burrito this morning. Breakfast burrito. Mostly protein. I imagine it's just eggs. It, it was stuff. eggs and three types of meat and uh, hash brown. Clarissa says, man, I'm late, late, but hey, welcome to the live stream. Regardless, we appreciate you dropping by. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Maybe we'll get to 175 likes. And Kmu showing up to the membership. Thank you so much, Kmu, Eddie, for joining our channel membership. This comes with exclusive playing Tetris with James at night. <laughs> He'd be like, cancel, cancel. I know he would say that. You know him so well. Kosh says, wow, Eddie's showing off. <laughs> I love when other people pick on Eddie. It's the most fun thing ever. It pains you to say thank you. I know. Doesn't it? I'm like crossing like my legs, pinching my thighs. No, I really appreciate it though. <laughs> oh, what's he doing here? What are you doing here? There's nothing for you. Uh, oh, he looks even cuter today. Hey, what do you want? Kiss. Your lips are spicy. He knows not to kiss it. Look. See? He was gonna. He didn't kiss it. Oh, Eddie. This is my favorite way to pet him. Like a basketball. Because he closes his eyes. But I don't hit him hard. Everyone's like, Hedy, Hedy. So anyone that's a channel member, now is the great time to use that Hedy emo emoji. Drop some Hedy emojis in the chat. Uh, cute Shiva, yes. Hannah, good night. Thank you again so much for the super chat. We really appreciate it. You're awesome, Hannah. And, and good luck with the move. move. Yeah. To test it. That's kind of where Habuya is, FYI. Oh, yeah. Dinah says, I'm loving Hedu's black nail polish. There's Michael dropping the Hedu emoji. Oh, thank you, Julie, as well. Dropping Hedu some love. Oh, look at him. Hedu. That emoji, how emoji is, is an actual picture of Hedu. Yeah, it's not a random Shiba, but yeah. 
helicopter ears. Is he doing it? Yeah. Hedu. Oh, oh, look at it. Look. Hedu. Oh, but he's probably scared that I'm going to do the siren. Cute doze, right? Bipolar says he looks so done. Yeah, he, he always looks like this around us. That's why I have like issues on like, do you love me? Or are you just like over it? He's a very kind of like a cool, like, you know, not in your face dog. Except when we're at sleeping at night, his butt is in your face because he's sleeping at a different angle. Hedy's like, don't talk trash on me. Hedy, stop looking at me as I eat. He's staring at me. Yeah, Julie says, Hedy's totally side-eyeing James. Hedy, look here then. Hedy, don't stare at people when they're eating. He's cute. This is spicy. Come on, hey, do you bring up Dogecoin? Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Oh. <coughs> oh, oh, you want down? You want down? Ah. Bipolar, he is turning 12 in October, so he is an older... Oh, he's grumbling. He's over this. Yeah. Stray Cat, if you're interested in becoming a member on this video or on our main channel, the our, our main channel, there's a button that says join. You just click on that and follow the instructions all the way through, and that's how you can become a member. Detective hairdo. Oh my gosh, Kim, thank you so much for joining the channel membership. Did you know, last second, like just slide right in there towards the end of the night. We appreciate you joining. Oh yeah, Emerita. Oh, good memory. Yes, Emerita. Hedu is turning 12 on October 20th. Julie says, Molly totally side eyes me when cuddling with Bubba. Letting me know that I'm the side piece. Cute <laughs> how dogs have their own like way of thinking of things. He's still, oh, he's still staring. He's at still him. looking at James. Uh, Hedu, you're scaring me. You can't see him, huh? Do you yeah, see his ears? Dang, push me. Is he there now? Uh, Island Candies, yes, it's a subscription-based uh, membership, so it's four ninety-nine a month if you're interested in joining. But again, no pressure. It's we just love there. All viewers, members or non-members, but this is something new that we're trying, and just a way for us to do something special for members, right? Yeah. So the badge, the special emojis. We're thinking about doing uh, members-only content, but nothing set in stone. But again, we're not taking away any content so if you're just viewing without membership you're still going going to get us the way that you know james and mark nothing's going to change for anybody but yeah. just additional perks for the members that's it chris asks, does how do you have a favorite depends on what his objectives are give, give, give examples i want to know what you're thinking um Usually I wake up a little bit earlier than James um, throughout the week. And over the years, Hedu doesn't like to wake up. He likes to sleep in. So I know he loves James more in the morning because they both get to just pass out. So as soon as I even get up from bed, Hedu takes over my spot and then they sleep in the same direction. Like if one's facing this way, the other's facing the same way, you know, or if they're one facing inside the bed, the other was facing towards each other. So it's like they, they mimic each other in terms of body positions. <laughs> uh, and if he feels like I'm trying to take him out, then he'll like actually go underneath the bed to hide from me. So I think in, in that aspect. He even hid it from me this morning. He wanted to sleep in a little even bit more. Yeah, yeah, I didn't take him out until like 10.30 was when he was ready. Wow, hey, yeah. 
living on the wild side, aren't you? <laughs> okay, I don't think I can eat anymore because it's just way too spicy for me to enjoy. It's we, so good, though. We pretty much ate the whole thing. We. It's, it's really good flavor. We even have let we even pour half of it out, so we could even make more fried rice later. In oh, the you're way. crazy! And there's still some batter left, but I don't know if you're gonna fry that up. Oh, do you want me to? I can't. It's okay. Maybe later. <gasps> we got another channel oh membership, gosh. Jansen. Thank you so much for joining our channel membership. Enjoy oh that gosh. French fry badge, and we'll see you on the community tab. That's where it's at. That's where all the content will be posted. Thank you so much, Jazz. Yes. All right. It has come towards the part of the night where we must say adieu. Adieu. Adieu, adieu to you and you. Minari, minari. Minari, minari, minari. Not something bad's going to happen. No, Minari is good thing. It's actually a good thing. Good yeah. things. Yeah. I feel like um, it, it was a great dinner, and I just loved how you made all these different dishes tonight. Like, it was nothing. Um, I know. I felt like it was a hodgepodge, but not really either. Because it's still stuck with the Korean food. It's definitely Korean food themed. Oh, you night. know what? Next time, if we ever do these two together, we should actually eat them together. Because that's not, oh, well, it actually has a serrano pepper. So it's low. That was a perfect, like, spice. Level spice. So, oh my God. Oh, bipolar, you're so sweet. Payday is tomorrow. So you best believe I'm becoming a member tomorrow. Love you oh guys. My gosh. That's so sweet. And yeah, feel free to sign up whenever you want. If you wanted to do it during the stream, that way we can, like, shout you out. We're cool with that. If you want to do it before, we'll make sure the next time you pop on, uh, we can give you a shout out then. But thank you, everybody. Uh, for joining us for another Monday Night Mukbang. Check out, if you haven't yet, please subscribe. We have a new video. We're super excited for this video on Wednesday because the food is delicious. And if you are a new channel member, head over to the community post. You'll know exactly what we're making on Wednesday, 4 p.m. Pacific. we've been wanting to eat this for year, for over a year. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a long time. And we finally got to eat it. And it was amazing. It was really good. Really good. Maybe a short video, but it's okay because that's just how much we enjoyed it. Yeah. Um, and check out one of our other videos, and we will see you guys next time. Have a great week. I'll do. I'll do. I'll do to you and you. Bye. 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 Bye.